Yes, well, welcome back in. Well, the safety net for the Sacramento Kings is officially gone. Now, tomorrow evening, they face the Golden State Warriors in San Francisco for Game 6. And it's as simple as this, people. If the Kings lose, their season is over. If they win, they force a winner-take-all Game 7 on Sunday right here in Sacramento. Now, despite the stakes, optimism and morale was high at Kings practice this morning. Like I said it last night, uh, we've been in this situation all year. Um, we lose a couple, um, they think we down, then we come back and win a couple in a row. So um, just another task in front of us. Especially because we're a younger group. I think you know, guys are ready to play. Um, you know, we have a, a short-term memory. I think that overall the energy um, and the looseness is, is appropriate for where we are. I think that you know, we're ready to play tomorrow. Well, for us, we like we like the quick turnaround. You know, uh, we, we want to play as, as soon as we can. and. Uh, you know, we got what we want, so we'll see if we can go get it done. We got to get it done, no question about that. Now, tip-off for tomorrow's game is set for 5 p.m. Again, if the Kings win, the series will come back to Sacramento for the Game 7 finale. That game is scheduled for Sunday and rumored to be at 12.30 in the afternoon. That is if necessary, of course. Now, the Warriors have lost just eight games at home this entire season and have yet to lose at home in the playoffs. Now, Luke, I really like what Harrison Barnes said. They're having short-term memory. I remember yeah. a past coach of mine once said, you got to have the memory of a goldfish, meaning right. you forget everything 10 seconds, 50 seconds after and just go out and play your game. And the Warriors, of course, not going to let the Kings forget that they are the defending champs. There's nothing the Kings would like better, though, to, than to give them an L on their home court. Oh, yeah. You want to dethrone the Warriors on their home court and force the game seven. We'll see what happens. All right. Thank you, Kevin.